Hey guys, I've been here today. I'm going to be showing you how to idle for some Steam trading cards. So the method has changed from quite a while ago. Uh, Steam Master is no longer in development, so there's this new program which is much better in my opinion and will help you out a lot. So I'm going to link to the download page in the description below. So just click on that right now and you'll be linked to this page. So once you're on this page, you want to just click on asf.zip down here in the download section and just wait for that to download. Once that's downloaded, we want to go to our downloads folder and then double click to open it. This will open up another window with your zip. Then what I'd like to do is make another folder and name it ASF. We're then going to drag the contents from the zip folder here into the new folder. And now we're just going to go into that folder. Then we want to click on the asf-configgenerator.exe. So double click on that to open it up and just wait for it to open. So we'll try to give you some sort of tutorial. I'm just going to skip all past it because I'm about to show you how to use it. So, once we're into this program, we just want to click this plus up in the top right and then just enter a name. I'm going to name mine idle because I'm using my bot for idling. So I'm going to enable core to true. So click the drop down and go to true. And then I'm going to enter in my Steam details. This program is 100% safe, so don't worry about it stealing a password or anything. It will be 100% fine, I promise you. All right, so once we've got all our info in here, we just want to click on the X and then just press OK, OK, and just close it. So once we've closed it, we want to actually open up the asf.exe. Wait for all the uh, text to come up, and it may take a while depending on your internet speed and computer speed, but just give it a little bit. So now that it's all loaded, it's asking me for my two-step authentication code. So I'm going to give it that. I trust this program completely. So I'm going to enter in my code press enter and then it says successfully logged in logged in to i steam user auth checking my badge page now what it's going to do is check the cards that you don't have and try to idle for them so currently it's idling for punch club and it's going to get the cards that i have for that so you can see i'm now playing punch club uh, but i don't actually have the game open so if i go to my profile then badges then i scroll down you'll see that it says stuff like two card drops remaining two card drops remaining. I've got lots of card drops. So it's actually gonna idle for all of these while I'm just doing other things. So it's not gonna use up lots of resources because it's literally just running in the CMD window. So you can just minimize that and it'll just keep running. Uh, so it actually currently says that it will take me three days and 14 hours to get all the cards that I have. I have apparently 164 cards. So if I sell those, I can get quite a bit of money in the long run. So if I search for punch club, you can see that I've got one card drop for Punch Club, so it's currently idling for that one. And once it's idle for that one, it will move on to the next game. I really hope this tutorial helped you guys out. If you liked it, please drop a like down below. If you didn't know already, I've currently got a 10k subscriber Q&A uh, thread going on. So I'm going to be doing a Q&A for 10,000 subscribers. And I've got a thread where you can post your questions on and I will answer them in the video. So if you're interested in that, the link to that will also be down in the description below. I hope to see you all in the next video.